Hello guys, uh, this is Jerundus Alpha, and the problem is I had everything recorded, and then my phone decided it didn't want to work, so I gotta record this whole thing again. <laughs> well, that was fun. But anyway, besides, it wasn't gonna work because YouTube only allows 15 minute increments, and it was almost 20 minutes long, so we're gonna have to cut this head down in, like, two parts, probably. Anyway, this is actually going to be a request for my friend, and his name is... Uh, Dragon of the World, he does amazing, uh, he may, does amazing, um, writings, and his, uh, and, and if you can check him out, that'd be awesome. He, he's really good at it, and it's very, very compelling, and you do a great, great job, Joe. So, also, how you doing, man? So, this is actually for you, but, um, anyone can watch this, obviously. So, I'm gonna start off with, uh, both dragons, we're gonna do frontal view, and we're going to start with, and we're also going to do a profile. And then over here, I'm going to try to teach you how to do wings the best I know how to do. I'm, I'm sorry, I'm not a pro at drawing wings, but I, does, it does, it, I do, I can make it look good. <laughs> Alright, so we're actually going to start off with the frontal view first. And I just want you to start every, every creature or every human, cat, dog, fish, everything starts with a circle and generally you want to start with the head because if you cho choose to do the legs you can do it but you also can you, you you the problem is you offset what's going on and uh, essentially what will happen is your legs uh, in the picture are going to have too much uh, the, the legs are just going to, when you get to the head, you might overlap on the page, and then you're going to have to start all over again. That's why we choose to do the head, since that's kind of the primary area you usually look at in a picture. Usually. Unless you're weird. <laughs> but anyway, uh, so we're starting off with an oval, really, because this is the kind of dragon we're going to make. Unless you're making some kind of toothless dragon, you're going to not, you're, you're not going to need a second snout. You're just going to need a circle. Those are actually kind of fun to draw, just saying. But it's uh, it's the, the way that they're drawn. Anyway, we're going to do another circle, but it's going to be overlapping. It's actually going to be another oval, but it's going to be overlapping, like I said before. And uh, actually what you're going to do is you're going to erase this. You're going to erase the part in the middle where it's overlapping, and it's going to become a snout for the dragon. Now, uh, each dragon is different, obviously, but these are all the mythical, uh, myth yeah, mythical creatures, sorry, that, uh, the thing is, you can do whatever the heck you want with them, honestly, and, uh, it'll make them look good anyway. <laughs> you're supposed to follow basic principle of a dragon, obviously, but because they're mythical, we don't, they don't exist in real life, so we can do whatever we want, but they are still awesome creatures, I gotta say. Um... Alright, so we're on three minutes right now. I gotta get this show on the road. Um, so basically, I've drawn out the head, and I'm just gonna draw out the eyes, basically. Like so. My dragons are looking very, very drunk right now. I don't know why. The other ones looked better. Unfortunately. Of course, the first one that didn't work is going to look better, right? Uh, that's how life works. It's like, oh, ha, 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 ha. Okay, I'm done. Sorry. I probably, I probably lost subscribers because of that. <laughs> I'm just kind of, uh, I'm freelance on uh, DeviantArt. I'm also freelance on on YouTube or anything, to be honest. My, I'm freelance all in my whole entire life. You could talk to me anytime. I, I'm down to talk. I'm doing RPs with different people. I don't know why I'm doing that. It's very, very weird, but fun, I guess. Um, Alright, so what we're going to do is we're just going to do a basic oval, like so. I know this looks kind of like a wolf, and we're also going to also add, like so. And we're going to add that. Can you see that alright? I don't know if you can. I'm hoping you guys can see that. I'm not I'm not gonna like much if I go back on here and they'll be like, we can't see the picture, and it's like, I gotta redo this whole darn thing again, don't I? <laughs> Alright, so we're just gonna... So basically what I did here, I'm just gonna kind of move it up. I can't do this darn and darn phone. 
Alright, so we're looking at the dragon like this. So you see what I did there? Um, that's essentially what you're gonna do. Uh, actually, what you need to do is eye slits. For some reason, my eye slits are looking like a uh, deranged weirdness. And I want you to go straight down, because we're gonna do a long neck dragon. So it's gonna be straight down on both sides. Generally, you want to hit the top like this and then come down. Because then it just makes it look like it's skinny and it's oh, it's underfed and it's going to die soon. Oh, I'm just full of funny jokes today, aren't I? No, not really. I'm not that funny. Um, so basically that's what I did there. Why is this looking like a freaking weird... I don't, I don't know. Anyway, so I'm also going to come down from basically a race a little bit and then I'm going to come back up like so and we're gonna go down we're gonna we're gonna go at an incline yeah, it's incline. yeah that's right we're gonna go on an incline and we're gonna basically start making where we would have the legs and things like that I'm going to do the same to this side I'm not going to explain it again but basically you're just gonna go incline legs this looks weird why does this look so weird why 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 well, my gosh I'm getting really irritated because the other one was really good and this one's really sloppy. I don't know why. Alright, that, that looks okay. I'm sorry, guys. Why is it looking so weird? Okay. I'm done with my rant. Anyway, so you're going to go incline and then basically straight down. Just do straight down. It'd be better that way. Um, so, in the other one, I did, like, these, these, um... What are they called? Horns. But, honestly, for each dragon, they're different each time. And you don't have to do the devil's horns. That, that's what they kind of look like to me, actually. But uh, th th this is an idea for perspective. If you ever want to do it like this, and that is not, like, any kind of stupid. Uh, I'm not going to explain. Basically, I'm trying to show you perspective right now. And what you're going to do is you're going to go down. Use a ruler if you're actually going to do this. I'm not using a ruler, and I'm lame sometimes. And basically what I did there was I just followed this line. I went to the point, and I drew out the dragon like so. Oh, man, I'm going to get so much hate for this. Um, so anyway, I'm going to teach you. Uh, so basically what you're going to do here is you're going to go straight down, and you're going to curve along with this, with the, with what I did here. Why is this looking? This is seriously looking weird. Anyway, um, so you're going to have the dragon like so. This is a very, very long neck dragon, I know. Sorry, guys. Not a perfect. And I'm also not very happy with this picture. I'm just gonna go across like this so we're just gonna do that uh, and I also want to show you how to do scales real quick so uh, what we're gonna do here is we're gonna go like so so basically I want you to just do a bunch of W's W W W W W W now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to the part the middle of the W and I want you to start a U there and then I want you to go W W, 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 you get the idea. Oh my goodness, my hand is so tired right now, I don't know why. Uh, I'm going to do the same thing here. I'm going to start getting lazier, or you could do circles. It's good to do dragon scales. You don't have to. I'm just trying to teach you essentially what you're supposed to do. I am cheating completely right now by doing this, and I'm sorry, but I can't be on here forever. Um... And basically what I did here was I just put two lines right there, indicating where the nostril's going to be, just indications of detail and things like that. Yeah, this one turned out pretty good, I guess. Uh, I'll give myself a, a, a D right now. This is terrible. Anyway, so that's essentially what you're going to do with a frontal view dragon. I really hope that helped. I'm sorry if it didn't, because that was absolutely horrible. Now... What I want you to do is start with a profile face dragon. I got nine minutes right now. I'm probably going to cut it in half right now. Probably a good idea. What do you think? I think I will do that. But uh, So we're going to start with this, and as soon as I come back. Uh, this could be part two, just so you know.